Hey everyone, I'm George Rodriguez. Come into my studio. I am an El Paso born, Seattle, Philly based artist who makes large scale ceramic sculpture. Vima, I love Vima. My relationship, it first started when I was invited to have a solo show uh, at the museum. And even though I know Bainbridge a little bit, you know, I hadn't uh, ventured into Bima yet, but they invited me to uh, exhibit and they actually provided my first solo museum show. So I'm very grateful to Bima. My work has changed a lot since exhibiting at Bima. Uh, when I first started with them, you know, I'm, I was working with like guardian figures and I like to respond to the space. So I was, you know, it was nice to work with the curatorial team and figure out like what work is going to best be showcased in that uh, gallery. Um, and since then, it's really expanded to public art and looking at architecture a little bit different. So they, Bima kind of was a catalyst for me to like move into um, more museum shows and also just like public artwork. The Pacific Northwest has been so nurturing to me. I moved here to attend graduate school at the University of Washington. So it was like my baby. I was like cradled through the school and like raised as a baby artist. Um, so I made a lot of connections with curators, um, galleries, different artists, and really build up a strong community of support. Um, and, you know, BIMA has been a big part of that, as well as other institutions in the region. But um, I feel, even though I've spent half of my time in, Seattle, in like the Pacific Northwest and half of my time on the East Coast, I still feel very like connected to this region because of um, the bonds that I have with like the people around here. Most recently, some of my projects include a large scale commission at the Kansas City Airport. So they just built a brand new terminal and I was one of the uh, percentage for the arts commissions. So I created uh, nine large scale jazz musicians since Kansas City is a large jazz town. Um, and I'm so grateful for that. I had a work in the National Museum in Sweden, uh, in Stockholm. So that's a big, you know, that's uh, my first international collection and it's part of the American Crafts collection. So I'm just super excited about that and I get to, you know, travel to Stockholm. And I don't know, I've just had a lot of, uh, a lot of success with different, getting my work into different collections and also just like, um, being more creatively free with the things that I'm making.